Good afternoon, everybody. Hey, I don't think I need any introduction. I'm Ted Wilson, Jr., president of Universal Benefits. I'm standing here today on this warm summer afternoon in South Carolina. I, I cannot believe it. I'm just sitting here with chill bunks on this warm afternoon. I'm sitting here with one of our uh, leading directors, Rodney Richburg, and I am standing here with Miss Cherie Buckman. We are so happy and so proud of her. Yes. Cherie just closed on her beautiful home here. Uh, she invited me over. She invited us over to hang out a little bit tonight. Her and her husband just uh, closed on a beautiful home. Now, this this, this is this is awesome. Wow, this, wow. This is awesome, awesome, awesome. Um, how many square feet you got in there? Four, how many? 4,300. 4,300 square feet. I know you called me up and you said, Ted, I got something I want to show you. I need you to come on over. I, I come over here. Okay. Wow. Let's go. You know, everybody it's, come. And it, everybody it was so come. funny, Rodney. You know, it was so funny because um, I was, I'm looking to purchase some land right back here. Because we're over here by Wilson Hall School. This is just like one of the best areas. Yes, sir. Yes, now, Sheree, sir. Uh, you know, we get a lot. I'm so proud of you. We get a lot of people that call you. Yeah, how are you and Rodney doing this thing over there at Telesales Division? I mean, and the thing about it now, a lot of people don't know, but you work directly with the other young lady, uh, uh, Miss Brianna Hart, that we had. You know, she's popular kind of on, yeah. on YouTube. Uh, she just closed on a beautiful home. Also, too, and you got a few other young ladies working with you. They're all making over a hundred thousand dollars a year. You doing it? You must be doing large. Just tell us your little story about you guys for a second. Well, um, I was already making six figures before I came. Right. 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 But you know, I still felt like I was struggling. Still right. behind on bills. I right. lost some cars. Right. All of that. Right. You know, I right. got paid on the sixth and the twenty-first of each month. Mm -hmm. Right? So I decided to go back into maybe doing this part-time to get a little extra income right, right. to add on to that. Right. So I was introduced to um, Rodney Richburg um, right. by Miley Smith. Right, right. She wanted me to talk to him, sat right. down, talked, and I have a 15-year financial background right. as well, so right. I understand numbers. Right. So right. when Rodney broke down the numbers, that's right. Cause I was, I, not the I'm contract. Not, not the contract. He broke down the he numbers. He broke down the numbers. <laughs> okay, right. 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 So I'm like, okay, the numbers look right. I understand that. So that. That will work for me. I understand that work. But you know, at first, you know, it's like, okay, well, let me try this a little bit on a part time basis. Right. So I started doing it part time. I was, even though I was already at six figures, six um, months in, doing 40 hours a month, I was making over half of what I was making at ATT. Right. So my thought pattern was like, if I'm doing 40 hours a month, making this, what I'm do if I do 40 hours a week. Right. And can I ask you a question? Mm -hmm. Did you have any residual income at AT&T? No. Okay. All right. That's that's big. Now, for folks out there, again, that's vesting, our residual income, our renewals, and our back-end money. That's what we call vesting in the insurance business. But So you didn't have any of that at AT&T? We're not picking up at AT&T here. Great company. <laughs> no, but, no. Uh, yeah, great company. Right. But see, my residual income right now mm -hmm. It's one and a half times what I made at AT and T a month. Wow! One, so, and and how long were you at AT and T? How long were you at AT and T? I was there eleven years. Wow! So you've been here. So you've been here how long? Full three times, three years. Okay, so you've been here actually four, but you've but been doing it full time for, three for years. Three years, right? Yes. And, and so, so Rodney just put you, plugged you into the to the system, and uh, now, and you also have your your these sub agents mm -hmm. that are earning. Uh, agents that you work with, they're also earning over hundred thousand dollars a year. That's correct. And you and and you all just work that telephone all the time. Oh, uh, can you can you explain to uh, folks out here about our about our lead system? Do you, do you like our leads? I love them. Okay. Okay. So one thing that I've learned to listen mm -hmm. to the coach. Mm -hmm. At first, I didn't understand it. Mm -hmm. I don't understand why people have issues with ordering leads. Mm -hmm. I order. Matter of fact, just this last one, I ordered 143 um, leads. Wow. Because my goal is I know Woo. I'm going to go over 20. Today is the 9th. I'm already at 12,000. Right. Um, and, 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 so the lead system is everything. If you don't have activity. Right. Activity. Right. Activity. Activity. And here's my thing with the leads. Mm -hmm. It's always an opportunity to speak with someone. But I have probably, I figured out, uh, we had went, we already had asked us about how many leads we had in our database. I have over 8,000. So that tells me. Um, I have probably four or five thousand more potential clients. Mm -hmm. It's not about twenty leads if I'm gonna close them all. Mm -hmm. If I can close just one or two out of the twenty, mm -hmm. which my closing ratio is about 30, 40 percent anyway, right, right. but just closing one or two surpasses that lead charge. Mm -hmm. And course, then yeah. some. Right, of course. And, and, then, then, some. And, then, and then some then you get your referrals and all that. 